Hello, I'm Matt Goat from house.com and this is a 2020 GNU Billy Goat Wide Snowboard. This is Temple Cummins all mountain free ride hard charging intermediate to advanced level deck for people who have big feet. If you have a large boot, it's always best to get on a wide board so you don't catch your toes and your heels when you're ripping down the hill. Uh, the Billy Goat is a hard charging directional free ride deck that is kind of I don't want to say centered up, but it feels a little bit more forward progressive than most directional free ride boards. Now, the board is set back with its stance only three quarters of an inch, not really too much for a directional deck. Outside of the nose contact point, the nose is a little bit longer, a little bit taller, and there's a 40 millimeter taper in the tail, just a little bit, not too much. Uh, but the thing that really stands out with that stance positioning, with a directional shape, is this C3 profile shape, the most aggressive, and precise feeling profile of the lineup. It's a camber dominant, it means that's an, it has a nice little arc to it as you see, but that arc has a reverse camber shape between the feet that's raised off the snow, make it a little less, uh, less hard charging, if that makes sense. But for the most part, it's got a really unique feel. Temple uses this board, surprisingly enough, for uh, riding bank solemn, which I think is interesting because it has a fairly long running length, and a fairly large side cut radius, but he also rides this thing in backcountry and big mountain terrain, which is really nice. Uh, the Billy Goat does feature a very lightweight wood core. It's called the G2 Eco Core. There's two strips of polonia near each edge. The rest is aspen. There's a biax fiberglass on bottom, triax on top, which gives it loads of energy, and it's a nice add-on with a C3 profile shape. And then there's that centered style base. This base absorbs lots of wax. You need to keep it waxed up throughout the season, so keep an eye on it. And then there's magnet traction edges. Now, the Billy Goat's magnet traction is a little bit more mellow than what I've seen in some of the other boards. Uh, the magnet traction actually has seven serrated knife-like blade bumps that help you to grip on firm snow. So you can take the Billy Goat in a wide range of terrain. You know, if you're riding hard pack and you need a, a progressive or a very like powerful style uh, Profile shape, you have it here. But then when you take in big mountain applications, there's a tapered tail, the nose is a little bit wider, the nose is just a little bit bigger too, and it helps you stay afloat. So this is a, a great deck if you're a hard charging rider who likes going fast. Uh, feeling flex rating, this bad boy is about a seven, it's different than your average deck, of course. And this is for the big footed riders because this is the wide version Billy Goat that you can check out at thehouse.com by selecting the link below in the description. Leave me a comment or a question. Let me know what you think of Billy Goat. There's a lot of people out there that ride this thing. It has a really sweet ass graphic. Again, um, subscribe to the channel there. Check out more vids there. And hopefully, see you guys on snow. Peace.